Bo 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 Dolph time. Hey guys, welcome back to Dolph time. My name is Dolph as always, and we're gonna be doing something a little bit different. Um, I know I did the Myers Briggs test a while ago, and um, some of the stuff I agreed with, and some of it seemed a little weird to me. Um, and I had some friends recently tell me about this uh, this new test. Oh, I guess actually this test has been around for a long time, but the Enneagram uh, test. It's a lot another personality test. So I was thinking it'd be kind of cool to do this so you guys could get to know more about me and I could hopefully get to know more about myself at the same time uh, <laughs> with everything. But if you guys are new to this channel, I'd love for you to subscribe. I put out new videos every day. Monday, Wednesday, Fridays put out too. I also do a lot of live streams on here during the week and I'd love for you guys to be part of that. But let's get into this. So honestly, grade each statement, yes for yes. This is really me, partly. This is partly how I am or no, this is probably not how I am. Uh, usually check no. Okay, so let's start with this off. I'm more sensitive than other than most people. Sometimes the world just seems too harsh. I'm more sensitive. I would say more sensitive than most. I would say partly. I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't disagree or completely agree with that. I don't get depressed easily. Um, as agreed. I plan the next adventure before the current one is finished. Uh, I would say no, because I want. I usually, I'll make like, whenever I'm doing stuff, um, like at least work and like what I do in life. Like I'm just focused on that, and I just want to do the best at that, and then I'll do the next one. I don't try to plan too far ahead. Success, prestige, and recognition really matters to me. I want to win. Oh, whoops, sorry. Success, prestige, and recognition really matters to me. I would say yeah. I want to be successful in the things that I put my put my mind to and go after. So I would agree with that. Uh, I want to win the approval of those in authority sometimes even when I don't really like them. Uh, I guess let's say partly. It's not all the way there. Uh, I love to take care of people and I'm good at it. I would say yes. I tend to trust most people. I would say yes for that one. I'm strict with myself and others. Um, I would say I'm strict with myself, others. Like, I don't know, even though I know no one's perfect, I'm usually harder on myself than most than other people. I would say partly. I wouldn't say no, but I'm not gonna say yes to that either. I often refrain from acting as I'm afraid of, of being overwhelmed. Like, I refrain from acting as I'm afraid of being overwhelmed. What's the, like, I'm okay with being on stage in front of people like doing this kind of stuff. Um, I would say no. Um, I'm skeptical, suspicious, and doubtful. Um, some of that, it depends on the situation, so I'll say partly. Not definitely, not definitely not all the time. Um, it's important for to me that I'm admired by others, and many people do it, and many people do admire me. Um, it's not important if I'm admired by others. Like I want to just be the best person I can. Like it's not something. I would say no. I just do. I just do my best that I can with everything. I don't super care if I'm admired. I don't see much point in wallowing in negative. When I begin to feel anxious, I tend to throw myself into distracting. Yes, I would agree with that. In most close relationships, I give more than I take. I do like giving more than receiving, so I would say yes. I'm always aware of what needs to be corrected. Uh, I, I, I would say partly. I don't know. Sometimes I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I'm pretty domineering. Uh, 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 no. Um... It's hard for me to put my feelings aside even when it, I would say no. Um, if I need to get something done, even if I'm like, don't want to call the, I've had, I've had situations where I had to call someone, especially for work, even though it wasn't my problem or it wasn't my fault, it was someone else's fault, but it fell onto me to let the person know. I'm just like, I just got to get this done with because I have to do this. So like I would call the person and get yelled at and I'm like, well, all right, well, that's just how it is. I don't know what else to do. I'm sorry. And that's like it sucks. I, it's definitely not like a thing I enjoy, but um, I would say um, I would say no. Um, I could probably use a little more ambition. Partly, maybe I don't know. I feel like a, I'm pretty. I go after what I want in life. So actually, I'm gonna say no. I'm comfortable when people want an emotional response from me. I'm uncomfortable. Oh, I thought said I'm comfortable. I'm like, yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> Your happiness and your feelings are your responsibility, not mine. Um, uh, well, it depends on the person and what's happening. 
maybe parley i don't know like if the person's being unreasonable um i don't know i guess i'll say parley for better or worse i compare myself to others to assess how, how i'm doing um i would say sometimes i look at friends or family how they're doing stuff and kind of just like look at how i'm doing and just uh just see where maybe i could do better with things or i don't know but um i'm not i'm not i try not to oh, i compare myself to others because it's usually not a it usually never turns out good it's easy for me to accept other people and they seem comfortable around me because i don't judge them yes even though it's frequently irrational i sometimes worry whether people are talking i would say no i don't really care personal relationships are far are, vi are, are by far the most important thing in my life yes i'm more organized than most I would say partly I'm not the most organized, but I'm definitely not cluttered. Um, I don't mind taking a risk. I really like to beat the odds. Yes. I avoid expressing strong emotions. I would say partly. I don't know. Sometimes depending on the situation, it feels like it's weird to me. I am a true romantic. Yes. I'm a good networker. I know how to make connections. I would say partly. Uh, I feel like I'm pretty good with people, but I know there's been sometimes it's just awkward. Um, I am more loving than most people. I would say, yeah, I'm highly individualistic. Um, I would say partly sometimes I really do like the things that I do and it's not normal, but there's some times where it's just, that's a lot. I like this the way I am is a whole lot of people rules annoy me. No, while I'm very loyal myself, I frequently worry that other people are not going to be loyal to me. I would say, no, I'm more formal than most people. Uh, well, anytime you guys see me on here, I'm usually just wearing a t-shirt. Um, but in, in situations when I need the, when I need to look nice, um, I do, I'll say partly. I'm quite obtrusive and easy to get along with. I'm quite unobtrusive. Yes. I think it's obtrusive. I'm like, no, I get bored easily. Then most people are always looking for new experiences. Uh, I'd say no. Um, I really do enjoy new things, but I don't get ease bored easily though. I want to observe and think without myself, without giving myself away before I go into action. Yeah, I will say yes to that. People are attracted to me because I impress them. Um, I don't know. I always just try to be the best person I am. And I definitely have. There's been people like case in point. I just tried to be the best photographer I am for uh, the youth conference stuff and we did like a mini photo shoot with teenagers um, since the youth conference um, and one of the kids came up to me after the conference one of the times and he said hey I really like how the photos turn out it was one of the kids was actually in the photo shoot he's like what would you think about doing my senior photos and I'm like uh what what do you mean by that he's like well I'm a junior this year but I'm a senior next year but I'd love for you to do senior photos and I'm like I have never done senior pictures ever in my life He's like, well, can you do pictures like you did for the photo shoot? I'm like, yeah. He's like, well, sweet. I'm like, let's just do that then. And I'm like, all right then. <laughs> so I would say partly, I don't know. I just try to be the best person I am. So, um, or actually, I guess I uh, like the best person I am. And I definitely had people come to me for that stuff. So, um, I don't know. I would say yes to that, I guess. I come on pretty strong and sometimes am intimidate. I, I don't feel like I've come on strong. At least I don't think I do. I often resent it when I see people doing a slack job, uh, partly. Depending on the situation and how serious it is, I, I can really be mad at them. But if it's just kind of like a whatever thing and it's not like a time crunch, then I, I'm not always the toughest on them, depending on if it's common or if it's just like a one-time thing. But I'm attuned to anything that might be dangerous and I'm, se I'm, sec 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 I'm a security con- I am security conscious. Oh, it just means like I know what's happening around me. I would think I do. I think I am. I usually know what's happening around me, especially if something bad's going to happen. I don't like commitment. Who wants to be locked? I um, would say no to that. I'm more temperamental than most, but it's because my feelings are so strong. I would say no. Uh, I'm very competitive, but if it's anything outside of that, I usually can hold myself pretty well, I feel like, with my emotions. Nobody likes to be intruded upon, but I hate it. Or nobody likes to be intruded upon but I hate it. Nobody likes to be intruded upon, but I hate it. I will say no, I guess. That seems like a double negative. It's like nobody likes to be intruded upon, but I think it's I like it. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know why that's, that one's giving me, I don't get, I'm a little confused, but I would say no. I go along with what others want unless 
I have a very strong desire of my own, which I usually don't. Um, I would say partly. I try to get close to the people by being generous with my time, being generous with my time and energy. Yes. Um, I'm, I'm very much a person that feels like if you're going to, um, if I put my time and my effort into getting to know you, spend time with you and all that kind of stuff, at least to me um, and how I like receiving stuff, if you do that, that really shows like I'm trying to make an effort in this and it's not just like, hey, whatever, I don't care. Like it's not a big deal to me. Like I'm actually trying to do this. So that's, that's at least for me for that. So I'm going to do one more page and then I'm going to call it here and do like a two parter. So this will be part of it. And then the second one, I'll finish the test and then we'll figure out what's going to happen or what, what I am, I guess. When making a decision, I often ask myself, what option will yield the maximum enjoyment? Uh, sometimes I see life as, as a struggle that I intend to win. There's a lot of stuff they have to deal with. Honestly, partly. I'm not careful. I can't. I I can get isolated. Too isolated. I would say no. Sometimes I'm overextend. I overextend myself in trying to help people. I would say yes. So sometimes it's not all the time, but there's been times where I'm just like, whoa, well, wish I'd have done that. Even though I'm trying to be nice, that was not the greatest thing. I'm competitive and ambitious, but I don't think myself as yes. I would agree with that. I tend to avoid conflict. I would say yes. I am drawn to emotional intensity and not afraid to explore the depths, I would say partly. I am met met meticulous and facetious. I don't know what that word means. Even about details and other people find minor. Uh, I would say partly. It's important to me to feel as though I belong. I would say yes. So, awesome. Well, I'm actually, I'll do one more. I'll do one more and then I'll do the rest on the next episode. It would be the worst thing to be seen as others as a loser. No, um, just because sometimes you'll lose that stuff, but that's not like you pick yourself back up. I don't know. I hold a tight rein on my temper. I would say partly depending on the situation and how competitive it can be. I can get pretty heated. I'm not like punching or throwing people or like yelling at stuff, but I can get I can like there's like a fire that builds up in me <laughs> at certain points. Uh, no one would ever call me selfish. I would say yes. I'm a big procrastinator. No, I welcome a good fight as it clears the air. But no, um, as it clears the air. Like, would it make it like getting in a fight, like talking about stuff, getting stuff heated? If in that, does that mean like everything's good after? Because if that is what it means, then I would be okay with that, or I'm okay with that. I don't know, but just to get in a fight, just to clear the air, that feels like that doesn't need to happen. It's strange, but I think that there's something beautiful about sadness. No. To deal with fear, I always have. Uh, to to deal with the fear, I always have. I am I'm as nice and warm as possible towards everyone. Yeah, I would say just in case, because I always like, I never want to be the person where like, man, I was looking up to you. And the way you acted really put me down in the situation. I've had times where I'm just literally just trying to be the best person I can, just so I want to be as the like uh, for me, because just because I'm a Christian, I always want to be Christ-like in my life as much as I can. And like I've literally, I've had people with just me acting the way that I feel like I should be acting in the way that I am. I've had people come up to me saying like, "Hey." Um, like, I don't, I don't know if you know, but just how nice you were all like, especially some of these conferences and stuff. Like, I'm just trying to be the best, um, the best servant and the best caretaker for the things that have been put on my plate and the things I've been given. Uh, but I've had people come up to me just saying like, Hey, like, I don't know if you know this or not, but I really appreciate what you do. And I'm like, what do you mean by that? And he's like, well, you were just super nice. And this was one of the weekends, like when I first started getting in the, the conference stuff where I'm just like trying to figure stuff out. So I'm just kind of just, just wa not wandering, but I'm just like all over the place, just helping as many people as I can with whatever's happening. And they're like, I, I don't know if you know, but like just, I was going through a lot of stuff and I was just in like in a really, not, not a great place in my life. And it's still struggling with some stuff, but the way you're acting and the way that you're dealing with stuff even when some, because I remember one of the things like there, there was some crap that happened um, that I hand, I felt like I handled it the best way I could. I didn't know this person was watching me go through it. 
<laughs> but they're like, man, I just seeing how you handled the situations and the way that you reacted or interact with people. Like, I don't know if you know, but it really like it really spoke to me and how I should how I should act and how I should be. And I just really appreciate what you do and the things that you stand for. And I'm like, that's awesome. I didn't know. It's just crazy because it's the whole thing of like, this is usually with like kids, but it's like, hey, be the best person you can because you don't know who's watching, especially with like little kids. And so even when I try to be always be the best person I can with this situation. So yeah, so this is exciting. I'm excited to see what happens next. Like I said, I'll, I should be getting, getting done with the next video. But if you guys have any tips or anything uh, that you guys want to let me know or anything is a prayer for, uh, like I said, this is the Enneagram test. I have it on the screen. It should, I don't know why I wouldn't be showing this on the video. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to take that, um, the website I'm on to, it's a free one. There are some that charge you for some reason. I'm sure it goes like way more in the depth with everything. But I'm excited to see what happens next, guys. I'm really thankful for everyone. I'm just, I just can't wait to see what happens next and everything. But God, I pray you be with everyone watching these videos and on this channel, God. I pray you take care of them, that you bless them, let them be the people you called them to be. Let them be prosperous, happy, passionate about the things you put on their plate and the things that they're pursuing, God. And I just pray for wisdom, prosperity, favor, and blessing on the things that we're doing and the things that we strive for, God. So I just thank you for who you are and what you do and what you uh, continue to do in my life and everyone's life, God. So I just pray this on your name. Amen. I hope you guys are having an awesome day and an awesome week. And if you remember nothing else to do, remember it's Delph time. All right, I'll see you guys later.